please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Hey guys, Timmy here. And today I'll be showing you how to make a convenience store. This is step one out of six. Let's start. So we'll be making a 18 times 15 area building. It'll be four high, but we're gonna start with the high. So for the door, you'll be going eight, skip to an eight. So let's go ahead and build the area that's too high. And for this step, you will need 188 blocks of choice. And you also on my website you can also find the materials needed also in the video there as well. And I'll also leave a link to that page in the description. You go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Skip to one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then you go fifteen. 18, 15, 8, 8, 15, 18, 15, 18, 15, 18, 15. I see you with the next step. Okay, for this step you will not have any extra, let's go to the next step. Step 2. We'll just go one more up, that's it, we we'll should make a total of 4 high, we'll use dirt to get up there. For this step, we need 64 blocks of toys and 3 dirt blocks. Climb up. I was gonna just do it like you do it over there, but go all the way around. You're gonna go this way, this way, this way. Let's go. We're going to film the floor, you might want to remove the dirt inside first. For this step, you're going to need probably a shovel and 226 blocks of toys. I'm assuming you guys already know what to do, so I'm just going to go ahead and fill in the floor. Let's see if you don't know what, how to fill it in. That's the way. Let's go.
Okay. So no extra blocks for this point either. So that's good. Let's go to the next step. Step four. Build the door. So this one we'll need tools and clean a shovel. So that's okay. So for this step, you will need four glass blocks, four wooden pressure plates, two dirt blocks, two redstone torches, sixteen redstone dust, four sticky pistons. 82 blocks of toys. So for the starting step, we're gonna put one, two, three, four, and pick for this part. And then we're gonna go one, two, three, one, two. And repeat on this side. Then you grab a shovel or whatever tool you have, you dig dirt with, and go. You can go all the way up to this block and do the first couple that you did. You go this direction. Stop here, don't destroy that block. You need that block for later. You can save dirt for later. I can save the dirt for later because you can find the other dirt. You grab your redstone dust, you know, place them like that. Bring it to those blocks. Bring it to that block. Then you can grab your floor in it you destroyed earlier. Like that. Leave those two holes there. You don't need that anymore. Now what you can do is grab put two there and put two like so. Put your pistons down two up on each side. Like that. Three glasses for glass blocks right in front of them. Put a torch there, block there, or dirt there. Turn now with some dust. I'm short. Oh. My bad. I may have counted a little bit too short. Okay, if you mess up, just make sure you find it. Here, okay, so much for that. Let's go around this direction. I need two more. Just I think. I'm gonna do some pick up this up, make sure I actually follow the instructions correctly. This step. This step calls for sixteen redstone dust. That's exactly what I have. Just please do this all the way through. Like this. Like that. But where's my other two? I did this right. Did it right. Okay then. Yeah, it's how you're supposed to do it. If that happens to you, it's fine. Just okay. Just kind of get yourself some more quick. So we'll fix that on the web page as well. I'm gonna include two more extra. If I was correct, that's fine as well. Because that will. 
So the 18 redstone dust. Uh, for that step, for this step. So got it got my air. Go and place back now. We can place back the steer, the blocks. You're gonna place a block there, red some dust there, torch there, dirt there, redstone dust. So that's how it goes. Well. So you should have 16 dirt left and two red concrete left. You're gonna put those back where they were. Okay. So there we go, there's that too. And for this, I'm gonna quickly show you how to do this. You're gonna go like that. Like this. Like this. And like this. So this oh side's covered up on both sides. Alright, I included two extra just in case you misplaced something in there or did more than you're supposed to. So that's the door. So that's I finished. So now let's go to and also that wall I put up is just to hide the redstone traction rather than the pistons that you can hide a little bit of the piston you can see through the glass. Let's go ahead and go to the next step now. After I place down these two extra blocks, this chest and these other extra items I don't need. Okay, next step is step five. So, so for this step, we need 64 light source of choice and 128 blocks of choice. Now the blocks and light source of choice is depending on how you do it, but if you follow along, this is how you would do it. So, if you're following along, you go like this, this, and this. You make two, two, two. It's basically this pattern, but in repeated motion, all the way down to that. So, it's good. Okay, so that's finished. So no blocks left over, that's good. Unless you did a different pattern. That's fine as well. So for the final step, which is the final touches, this one varies on what you want inside of the store to look like. I'm not gonna tell you what to do on this one, but I'll give you a suggestion. If you wanna follow along what I'm doing, this is what I think a convenience store will look like. On the inside. 
For the way I think in the following the video, you will need one furnace, 23 trap chests, 44 bookcases, 35 chests, 4 signs, 3 stairs of choice, 1 gate of choice, 40 blocks of choice, 1 door of choice, and 1 crafting table. That's a lot of materials to remember. And a lot of the holding hand. So let's get started by going in my box of choice for the same as the wall. So we're gonna make my craftsmanship work by going four blocks out and going over to all the one block in for the gate. Destroy these two blocks. Grab your trap chest and put two there for the money or returned items. And put a stair there, stair there, and a stair there. Now for your your signs, you can put a sign and it's any message you want. On there, it could be a joke message, it could be some type of total money message. It's up to you. So, we're actually gonna repeat that four blocks out in the same way, all the way through, except the end. But this one, you know, actually build a little separate building within a building. This would be the staff storage room. This is where you store the extra store items and extra products. So, you can grab your chest this time. You know, double stack them like that. Before I place that back, I'm also going to do the pillar. So that's uh, blocks, there'll be no more use of those blocks. I'm going to put the crafting table there. Grab the furnace. First there. So I have something to cook the lunch with. Staff only. Put the door there. So now we've got book skip those two and put it all the way on the out of the wall. Put those there like that. Two Always make sure to put two areas where there's people walking. But don't break bookcases. Next time I get bookcases back and get books, I just have the silk touch on my axe. Okay, so we take your chest this time. You go one, two, you're gonna skip to one, two. And you're gonna skip two again, you go one, two. Skip two, one. Two, one, two, skip two, one, two, and skip two, one, two. Then you're gonna go one, two, one, one, two, one, and again one, two. And that's all for the chest. Now for the trap chest, you spill them, fill it in, like so. You're just gonna fill in any empty blanks with the trap chest so that you, you fit next to your chest. That's the only thing I can fit next to your chest. And there we go, that's all the materials we have. So now that's completed. We can just put back anything we don't need anymore. So now we have it's a completed store. So you can actually add cool some items into each chest and add some store items. And if you want, you can also add sides. That's also the reason why I like the two rooks. They can put sides in front of the chest, one of the bookcase. Then what items in the chest and how much it costs. I hope you guys enjoyed this short little video of the steps. Now I'll see you guys next time. Remember, 
the steps will be in the, on the website under the how to area. And make sure to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.